So before I go into this video, I just wanted to make sure everyone knows Corey's Rides is not sponsored. None of the products on this bike were given to me. I never got a discount on any of them. Nothing like that. I have zero sponsorships. This is all just my opinion, stuff I bought with my own money. So this is going to be the short video of everything I've modified on my 2022 CB500X. If you want the long version with more detail, check out the channel. I'll make a long version also. I'm basically just going to say what I've done and uh, what it is. So SW Motec light mount, Sylvania LEDs from a farm supply store, Madstad 20-inch um, windshield. It's adjustable. They have one size bigger, one size smaller. T-Rex racing skid plate, cheap Amazon cruise pegs, uh, Barkbusters VPS. This is a Tempe sensor for my Garmin Montana 700 on a uh, Moto Pumps mount. Uh, Insta360 X3, I think. Yeah, X3. Uh, Renthal dual compound grips. This is an ABS defeat switch that I built. Check out my channel if you want the 3D print and the information on that. Honda OEM accessory 12 volt plug. Giant Loop Diablo tank bag. SW Motec luggage locks. Uh, these are just RAM mounts. RAM quick grip. Uh, I believe it's the XL model. Then a uh, Curryock and throttle rocker. I shortened the levers myself. Um, I welded, cut and welded the shifter so it would fit my foot better. Those are Motion Factory Racing uh, foot pegs. This is a Puig kickstand plate. Honda OEM Accessory Center Stand. These are Happy Trail products, saddlebags. Do not use them. They're run by idiots. Uh, the, the product's fine, it's just I hate how the company's run. This is a two gallon Roto Packs, the Gen 2 version, on a luggage rack that I built. I also had an Outback Motor Tech rack that broke and I welded gussets, to, uh, if I could speak, I welded gussets into it. It's a f decent rack, it just can't take a two gallon Roto Packs flopping around on the back of it. Uh, that is a, a 3D printed license plate frame that I made. I'm running 150, 70, 17 tires in the back instead of the 160, 60s. These are Heidenau tires. I've gone through several sets of tires already. That is a Black Widow exhaust out of England. That is a custom turndown I made to get the exhaust off of the saddlebags. Um, already did that, that. Um, so I think the last thing Last couple of things, there's a Speedo DRD under the seat to fix a speedometer error for running a different size tire. And this is a Russell Daylong saddle. You can also get the passenger seat done to match the front. You can get a backrest if you want it. If you don't, you don't have to get it. And it is removable and adjustable. So there is everything I've done to this CRF CB500X.